All right, here are the blueprints. Pylon is complete. Now to activate it. With this device, we can send a powerful electrical signal through the nervous system, merely rendering our enemies unconscious, or they can be reduced to ashes. What is your opinion? So yeah, it's basically, you can just knock everyone out, or you can kill- BURN THEM, PIERO! BURN THEM ALL! <laughs> I just love that that time. Yeah, you can kill them or you can spare. They mentioned I both. I guess you'd want to act decisively. It's Sorry, a what's simple that? adjustment. They mentioned both, and they're just like not even concerned about mentioning like sparing these people or murdering them in the same all breath. Ready, and there's like no reaction all to you being like, yeah, just kill them all. Oil tank Will you do the honors? When this arc pylon is charged, no now come in the here. happy ending. Look, guys, if both of these, if they're, if they're still alive, you actually, you see them working together and creating a cure for the mm. plague. Because you heard... Right, and if I remember... Yeah, when you they're come down, like... they're discussing, you know, oh, I, you know, what have you tried, what have, you know, I've tried this. Well, let's see what this has to say. Cursed dreams were All is ready for This oh. device will Just extinguish... Look, <laughs> he's going to so extinguish so many lives! I would prefer really he's, he's just so... He's just like a little kid who's going to immolate dozens of men. Alright, now now that we won't be interrupted, let's listen to this, uh... Record, we can listen to that recording again, I think. Maybe. Chock full of blue stuff. Okay, if we don't get back to it, that, uh, um, the recording of Pierre there, he's talking about, you know, he's having more and more disturbing dreams, and, like, he wants to, like, blow this place up in a, in a huge pyre, equal to his brilliance, as I believe he puts it. Again, it's, you know, he's going, in the, in the high chaos, he's going crazy. Right. Well, okay. Here we go. One, two, three. It's alive. Amazing, simply amazing. Destruction on a grand scale. And how that would Defies differentiate between targets? So well, I don't know. The other arc pylons could too. Remember? In an you could. Yeah. But I mean, at least in that case, there was this idea that, you know, it could check your charger well, or whatever. Well, he mentioned that he'd attuned it somehow. But this just was just a giant electrical well, field. Well, I hope we can be considered colleagues. Well, I don't know. It might have been specific, like, arcs targeting people we couldn't really see. Men like us rise above such... That's true. It was so bright. It was so bright. I believe men such also, as have luck start with... Also, notice Sokolov talking about, uh... uh it's it's kind of weird. Maybe even Pendle. I suspect he That's was beautiful. Lazy, but no one is prepared for the sheer seductive oh, yeah. influence. I have to say, so close to real power. Sokolov is really not in a position Once to be moralizing, considering when we met, considering we abducted him while he was doing Mengele-esque experiments on living human subjects with plagues. My work now, and you to yours, killing people. I mean. So he's not really one to talk about the value of human life. I expect that you will want to take revenge on those well, who wronged you. I do not know where no, they went, but no. it was by water. Old Samuel would know, I'd wager. We once discussed a system of signals to be used in Emily's tower for communication across the river. I wonder if he remembers that. All right. I'll make what you need. Before we go, this will be the last ch chance we ever have to spend money. Oh, explosive pistol shot and the sticky grenade. This will be our last. This will be the nice. last chance we'll ever have to spend money. So, no sense holding back. Just drop that cheddar.
Took a lot of juice to power that blast. <laughs> look, 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 like there's like those scorch marks on the ground. Where someone was standing. Where, where people used to be. Now, do you know if those scorch marks are static or are they assigned I think, to where? I think they go where the guys were. I, uh, I think. Uh, yeah, that's pretty cool. Sense. He's not handling the pressure as well as one might hope. No. Talk about setting off pyres, speaking of himself in the third person. Yeah, I'm pretty sure these go where guys were. Yeah, see, there's the body and there's the tall boy he was riding. Hmm. That's pretty yeah, cool. That's a nice touch. Speaking of which, Lister. Oh, one of them fell right on top of him. <laughs> yeah, there's Callista, Lydia, and there's Wallace. Nothing on Lydia. Oh, note to Wallace. My dear Wallace, we are departing for a safe and secure place where we can coordinate the transition of power to ourselves. Make certain that my audiograph and the best of the wines make it aboard the vessel before the sun sets. This evening, the staff will be rewarded for their loyalty and service. Like I said, this seems to like lend support to the idea that Wallace knew they were going to be killed since that since he apparently put the yeah. audiograph in the sewer. Callista, Callista, fret not. I believe there is still hope for Emily and Dunwall. I don't believe Corvo is gone. <clears throat> I'll be searching the river for him. But if you catch wind of him, shoot up a flare using the launcher I placed in Emily's tower, and I'll make my way back as quickly as I can. Keep this tower locked and take care of yourself. Emily is going to need you when this is over, Samuel. She probably does need her, and so it's unfortunate that, well. Yeah. Well, luck luckily Emily has a strong role model like Corvo to, well. Yeah. I don't know, maybe. Well, maybe Samuel can be around to teach her good morals as long as he doesn't die of the plague or... Well, never mind. Spoiler! <laughs> uh, general notice. <clears throat> be on watch for members of the conspiracy. <coughs> <coughs> Some are still at large. If discovered, they are to be killed on sight. Move the bodies into the kennel, but they are not to be otherwise tampered with. Piero Joplin. Missing. Interrogate, then execute. Anton Sokolov. Missing. Interrogate, then execute. Lydia Brooklane, Wallace Higgins, and Callista Kurnow, found dead. Corvo Atano, believed dead, assume missing, kill on sight. Samuel Beechworth, missing, kill on sight. Put the corpses in bags and keep them in the backyard. Do not disturb or search the bodies in any other way. And, um... Okay, notice Cecilia is not on the list. So, like I said, right. remember he said, I don't think Evlock even noticed I existed. Yeah. Yeah, she was so... Yeah. Out of the way. Oh. Oh, that unpleasantness is over with. Now, if we head back to... Uh, Cecilia's little hidey hole... She's not here, but look what is. Corvo, I'm going to make a run for it. I think that if I hadn't met you, I wouldn't be brave enough to try. I'll try to find you again someday when this is all over, Cecilia. I, I hope she was out of arc pylon range. <laughs> well, uh, yeah. I don't, I don't know. I'd like to think that he would, Corvo, despite being silent, would have told them. Well, he... Because I don't know how far the pylon goes. 
and then on the other hand, you know, there's no scorches that's, around that's here. That's true. We'd, so. we'd presumably we'd see like a pile of ashes or something. Unless it's maybe a block down and... Oh, general notice. Oh, that's the same one as before. Alright, back to the tower. Now we have the key. Ah, oh, that's a nice that's a nice sound to blink to, into. <laughs> well, no nightmarish Lovecraftian child art in here at least. Ooh, but lots of goodies. Subtle touch. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Uncle I hope you find this. I'm devastated. The girl I've been caring for. Kind of a gone. subtle touch, but Emily the fact that. Yes. Fire the Samuel signal! Daughter to the Empress. She's gone. <laughs> they took her away in a boat this morning. I don't know where, and her hair hadn't been cold. Samuel signal, I like it. I worry who will look after her. But you were saying it's subtle that, touch. You're talking about. She's, like she mentions, you know, they took her this, and her hair hasn't been. Her hair hasn't been combed. It's like, that is such a pointless, irrelevant detail, but it's something I can totally imagine someone really freaked out and flustered, just like, you know, just blurting out, you know? Like, they're trying to organize yeah. their thoughts. What can I make for you? This may be the last time. Anything? Yeah. Like, it's a dumb thing to mention, but it's a realistically pointless thing to mention. I like it. It's a realistically dumb thing to mention. You know, you're that, you know, you're that panicked and freaked out, you're, your mind's not, you know, filtering things, you're, you know, just blurting out whatever comes to mind. Yeah, it's clever writing, and I appreciate it. <laughs> it's like Larry Niven said, everyone speaks in first draft. So yeah, there are no more upgrades nope. for you to get. I have, I have nothing. Nice. Oh wait, there's combat sleep dark. There we go. Now there's nothing to buy. I don't think I missed any of the upgrade blueprints. Frequently, you've been checking uh, to get all your completion. I, I would assume so. Hey, Sam, how's it hanging? Just adjusting my quick, my quick ease. I'd find you yeah. here. It never pays to bet against you, does it? I saw the signal. I knew you'd be back, Corvo. I knew it. We should start well, off. Well, you are the one who feeling was something this? in my bones, and if it's saved played, him, so. I can't be counted on to drive this boat. That doesn't happen in low chaos. In high chaos, we're going to Kingsborough Island. That's where they've taken Emily. Good. Then it's one more trip across right. the river to where it meets the sea. That's where the Lord Regent was building his new lighthouse. Ought to be something to see. In low chaos, Samuel is healthy. In high chaos, he's contracted the plague himself at this point. All right. 27 hostiles killed. Used the arc pylon. Found Emily's drawing. And as you can see, there's very little to find here. One rune, no charms, no shrines, no paintings, and only a few coins. It's a, it's a very quick stage after the much, after right. the rather long of King's Pharaoh Isle. Long. The light at the end. The leaders of the Loyalist Conspiracy have moved to a monumental lighthouse, the final military project devised by the Lord Regent. They're holding Emily as they struggle to tighten their hold over the city. 
It's time to confront them, decide their fates, and determine the future of Dunwall. But yes, it's um. And actually, and speaking of Samuel and different chaos levels, we're going to see uh, something very different. We're going to it's going to make quite a big difference to our final encounter meeting discussion with him, I should say. Right here we are. This is very different to that case. Looks like they fought. Maybe over Emily just after they landed. I'll bet the Admiral's got her locked up in the lighthouse somewhere. And if he's lost the first round, he's probably dug in someplace. Doing his best to drink himself to death. I suspect it's Martin who's got the lighthouse under siege. They turned on each other at last. So the Admiral's power mad, Martin's a snake. And Lord Pendleton is a coward. And you, Corvo, the things you've done, you could be Ouch! I've seen a lot <laughs> traveling with you. Now get off my boat. Shit. Now get off my boat. Luck. <coughs> Ouch! Yeah. And now if your chaos is really high, you also get this. Like what you've become. No better than these traitors. That's why I'm going to tell them you're coming. Fires a flare. <laughs> he just glitched out of the boat. Yeah, if you... Well. If, if you kill him, they, they don't really have a specific falling out of the boat animation, so it kind of gets a bit wonky. But, okay, now, needless to say, in Low Chaos, he doesn't do that. In Low Chaos, he... In Low Chaos, right. he talks about how he admires you for... Not losing sight of, of right and wrong, even amongst all this, you know, craziness. And that he, you know, hopes to see you again. Oh, correct me if I'm wrong, in Low Chaos, this... It's, it's, uh, uh, it's yeah, that's right, exactly. Yeah, the weather is... In Low Chaos, this is a bright, sunny day. Wait, what? It, al like, it almost seemed like you were just going to uh, have a brief discussion with them over paternity <laughs> rights. I've got, I've got the blood test results, and... Corvo, you are the father. 